everyone, I'm here in Frau Gerold's garden with Richard Lee from ASUS. He's country manager uh, of Switzerland, of course. And I'm here to ask him some questions, or actually he is here for getting me asking some questions to him. So, <laughs> yeah, we're talking about sponsoring in esports right now. Um, you are sponsoring quite a lot. Um, why? Uh, it's, it's a big focus for ASUS is the gaming industry. You know, we've been here since the very start of the gaming industry. We've been pushing it ever since, and we're always going to be here pushing the gaming industry as well. So for us, it's a, a key, key focus in our product portfolio and our business model. Okay, wow, cool. And um, also, um, <laughs> you... Yeah, you, you said before, when you talked a little bit, that you see a lot of um, potential in esports, but what are you actually looking for in the teams? What are you vigilant of? Or about? Um, one thing we're trying to focus on at the moment in ASUS is actually focusing on the, the new games that are coming out. You know, we've had League of Legends and what we saw in South Korea a couple of years ago was that the, ten, the, the viewers in Twitch actually dropped in League of Legends. That should have been a big wake-up call to everybody. So what happened was is that Overwatch came in and it's actually boosted up the gaming part as well. The second thing we're seeing is player unknown battlegrounds games that are really kind of starting to push the graphics threshold and more and more people are getting watching Twitch on these games now so for us it's a big big focus to try and focus on these games we're looking at new games and another um, two areas we're looking at is for the gamers in Switzerland who are who don't realize actually how good they are. We saw this in uh, the Berlin FIFA Championships was a guy from London, came out of nowhere, got all the way to the final. He lost in the final, but again, he beat all the, the pros going into this. We also saw it in Switzerland as well with Media Mart and the FIFA Challenge. Some guys coming out of nowhere just to take the biz, take some, <laughs> take some, um, shots at the big guys and that was a good thing for us. The other thing we want to try and focus on is, get, is females in gaming, ladies. It's a big, big focus for us because I say it's people like Sarah Lou, Mystique, they've kind of blazed the trail over the last year in the worldwide scene. And we do have female gamers in Switzerland, but we need to get them more well known because I said there's some very talented people who are out there at the moment as well. Females, I like that. <laughs> well, if they are females, they are always, uh, I think, really good actually when they're playing in pro teams. They That's beat me. really cool. I'm, I'm looking forward to that, really. So, um, and if you are sponsoring a team, yeah. then what are you expecting of them? Um, one thing we want from team sponsorship in Switzerland is so we, 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 at the moment we've done a lot of tournaments, but one thing we've um, we want is actually kind of a bit more loyalty to us because we've been here since the start and we're always going to be here. We're not like brands like HP or anyone like that who's gonna, who've kind of just jumped into the gaming market. We have been there since a long, long time. And what you have to remember is that 70% of gamers are still building their own PCs. So for us, that's our core business. And we'd expect some kind of loyalty to us as, as a, what we found recently is a lot of teams trying to play us off against other brands and stuff. It's like, well, you can do that. But at the end of the day, are they going to be here in two, three years' time? And our guess is not, they're not going to be there. So for us, it's a big, big focus on the kind of working together in partnership together. So you say that you will be here for a long time. <laughs> and so what do you think, how is, how is going to be eSports developed? What, what will happen in the future? I think from a perspective from us is the, is the game types now. And we really kind of, our focus is kind of moving on to the to newer games as well that are coming out onto the market. I think what we're going to see over the next few years is a lot more multiplayer action games coming out. Um, Player Unknowns is a perfect example. It started off as a, a battle royal and now it's kind of moving on to team games as well. And that's what we see those games becoming as well. Those kind of survival games are moving on to team sports games as well. And I think the next logical step is to move them into the actual esports leagues as well. Great. So, as a last word of you, as already sponsor, what what do you say to other um, companies? Why is it good to sponsor in esports? Uh, I think for other companies is that it opens up a whole new demographic to them. I think if you look at the traditional TV mod, um, TV, the the Twitch streams now are almost hitting the same hours as 
um, viewing habits as TV. So almost averaging two hours a night or a, a, a day in in viewing figures for each person. So that's that's kind of borderline on TV part. And one thing I said that no company's done very well at the moment, and that is merchandise. Like. The guys like uh, New Era making the baseball caps and the, the, the works and stuff, all the t-shirts, the t no one's really kind of got into that part of it. And I said, the market is bigger than sports apparel, if you, or if you look at the user base. And especially when you look at um, the way uh, that you can interact with your favorite gamers, you know, you can even play against these guys. You can talk to them, you can learn from them, play against them. No real sport does that in the world. So that's why I said it opens up a massive, massive market for all these other brands like Red Bull, New Era, sporting apparel goods who kind of sponsor that part of it as well. So you say it's definitely worth of it. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. <laughs> uh, yeah, sun is also coming out because of joy. <laughs> So I say, I say thank you and yeah that was it. I hope you liked the video and yeah please comment if you have something to say as well and then I say thank you and I wish you a nice weekend. We have Friday at now. And right we got now, Sunday so. here as well so. Yeah that's true. <laughs> so bye. Thank you. Esports.ch Powered by UPC.